So here's how you do it. So you go into model setup, hit enter, let's start again. So yeah, go into model menu, hit enter, model setup, hit enter. Then you can go to a location if you want. So if you hit enter again, you can scroll up and down. Choose an empty space or one you've started on. Hit enter again. If you want to change the name, just hit enter on that. You'll come up with that keyboard. Just scroll across and call it what you want here. Say for instance, I just delete it. So to delete what's there, keep hitting enter. And you just go to J, J. So you hit enter twice. Up, R, C, and H, and go down to here, hit enter, 36, go down to done, hit enter again, so we've got the model name, you can go into um, this one for the icon, See, we're a multi-copter. So my default is multi-copter anyway. And the model type, make sure you've got it on multi-copter. You've got plane, heli. So go back to multi-copter, go down again. Make sure this is on 30 milliwatts, that's important, otherwise it won't work. With the E010 or the JJRCH36. Go down once more, and again. You can see that is the one you need, MJXQ. Once you've found that by scrolling, left and right you scroll. So once you've found that, hit enter. And you've still got to choose the model. So you've got to go through, there's E010, hit enter again. Exit. And you want to hit this down button here, go across, and if you hit enter, it should say it's binding. I think you have to plug it in first. So plug it in. As you can see it's flashing. I'm going to hit enter, and there we are, bound. So instead of having to use this, controller you can now use something better have a much better flight experience so it's worth getting just for the fact you can use it on your toy grade ones as well as hobby grade if you're interested in getting this then I'll leave a link in the description this one's from Gearbest just like to thank them for sending it for review and there you have it I'll catch you on the next video this is TJ